Since their inception, the Hells Angels have established their power and influence around the world. But despite being so dangerous and powerful, they have their fair share of enemies. What is the reason for disputes between them and other motorcycle clubs? And over the years, what fights and clashes have occurred? Join us as we count down the top 10 enemies of Hells Angels and explore which motorcycle Hells Angels top leaders fear the most. Number 10. The Rock Machine The Rock Machine, a new Canadian biker gang that emerged in the early 1990s, quickly became the arch-rivals of the Hells Angels. They aimed to challenge the Hells Angels' dominance in Quebec, igniting a violent clash that would be remembered as the Quebec Biker War. The Rock Machine established a strong foothold in the drug trade, particularly in Quebec, where they dominated the cocaine and methamphetamine markets. Their pursuit of power led to a fierce struggle with the Hells Angels over control of the lucrative drug industry. The conflict escalated into a bloody battle that spanned several years. One infamous incident occurred at Sherbrooke Airport in 1994, when a group of Hells Angels opened fire on a landing Rock Machine crew. Five Rock Machine members were killed, and many others were injured. The scene resembled a war zone, with bodies and shell casings scattered across the tarmac. Bombings and drive-by shootings became commonplace as both sides fought relentlessly. Tragically, innocent bystanders also fell victim to the violence. In a particularly harrowing event, a bomb planted in a jeep killed a drug dealer named Mark Dube, and an 11-year-old boy playing nearby lost his life due to the explosion's impact. The Quebec Biker War stands as one of Canada's bloodiest biker conflicts, surpassing even the New York Mafia's reign of terror in terms of brutality and civilian terror. Number 9. Iron Order The Iron Order, established in Louisville, Kentucky, in 2006, is one of the top enemies of Hell's Angels. Throughout their history, these two clubs have engaged in a series of harrowing and violent clashes marked by bloodshed and brutality. One fateful incident occurred in May 2015, where an Iron Order member callously gunned down a Hells Angels affiliate amidst a tumultuous confrontation during a motorcycle rally in Nevada. The echoes of this grievous act reverberated through the realm of motorcycle clubs. Just a couple of months later, in July 2015, the tension reached its boiling point once more when an Iron Order member savagely stabbed a Hells Angels member to death during a fierce altercation at a motorcycle rally in South Dakota. The profound animosity between the two factions was laid bare for all to witness as the clash claimed yet another life. The animosity did not wane with time. In September 2015, during a motorcycle rally in New Jersey, a Hells Angels member fell victim to the ire of an Iron Order member who coldly discharged their weapon, extinguishing life and intensifying the flames of hostility between the rival clubs. Number 8. The Bandidos Motorcycle Club The Bandidos Motorcycle Club, born in Texas in 1966 from a group of disgruntled Vietnam War veterans, swiftly gained notoriety for their violent and criminal actions. Their primary foe, the Hells Angels. The two gangs battled for drug trade control in Texas and the South, but the 1990s saw their rivalry escalate. A power struggle within the Bandidos led to a split, forming a new faction called the Bandidos Nomads. Seizing the opportunity, the Hells Angels recruited Nomads members, sparking a string of violent clashes. The 1996 gas station brawl in Denmark turned fatal, leaving casualties and injuries. The war raged on as the Hells Angels struck back in Australia in 2006. When uninvited bandidos arrived at a Sydney clubhouse, a brutal confrontation ensued, with Hells Angels members beaten and stabbed. Retaliating, the Hells Angels launched attacks on bandidos' clubhouses, including a brazen car bombing in Adelaide. Despite arrests and crackdowns, the war between the Hells Angels and bandidos persists to this day. Number 7. The Outlaws. The Outlaws, a Chicago-based motorcycle club founded in 1935, emerged in the 1960s as a fierce enemy of the Hells Angels. They quickly became one of the Hells Angels' oldest and largest rivals. Notorious for their violent behavior and involvement in criminal activities, such as drug trafficking and extortion, the Outlaws engaged in a relentless battle with their rival gang over control of the Midwest drug trade. One infamous clash occurred in 1984 
at a motorcycle rally in Michigan. Tensions were high as the Hells Angels set up camp near the outlaws. In the early morning hours, armed outlaws members launched a surprise attack on the Hells Angels, resulting in a brutal brawl that left multiple bikers dead and many injured. The feud reached a boiling point in 1994 when the outlaws launched a vicious assault on the Hells Angels clubhouse in Indiana, resulting in a bloody shootout and the deaths of several bikers. This incident marked the beginning of a long-standing and ongoing rivalry between the two gangs, characterized by hostility and continuous conflict. Number 6. The Mongols Founded in 1969 as a response to Hells Angels exclusivity, the Mongols became a notorious biker club in the U.S. Despite their smaller size, they gained notoriety for engaging in illicit activities like assault, murder, drug trade, money laundering, extortion, and robbery. The Bureau of Alcohol, Tobacco, and Firearms labeled them America's most violent biker gang. The Mongols clashed with Hells Angels in deadly confrontations. In 2002, three bikers died, leading to prison sentences for two Hells Angels members. Retaliatory strikes followed, with armed Hells Angels cornering the Mongols in Nevada, causing severe injuries. In 2008, Mongols stormed a Hells Angels clubhouse, resulting in a bloody battle and a Hells Angels fatality. The FBI's large-scale operation in 2008 arrested over 60 Mongols, including leaders. While weakened, the hostility between the gangs endures. Number 5. The Vargos The Vargos Motorcycle Club, founded in 1965, gained infamy for drug trafficking and violent clashes with law enforcement during the Vietnam War. With 600 members across 24 chapters in the U.S., Mexico, Canada, and Europe, they are a major outlaw motorcycle group in Western America. Engaging in illegal activities like drug and weapon trade and money laundering, the Vargos have clashed with the Hells Angels, their rival biker gang. The conflict started in the 1990s when the Vargos expanded into Hells Angels' California turf. This led to violent fights, including an attack in 2002 resulting in injuries and a 2011 clash that killed a Hells Angels member at a Nevada casino. Despite police intervention, the power struggle and criminal endeavors persist without resolution. Number 4. The Pagans The Pagans Motorcycle Club, formed in 1957, quickly emerged as a rival to the Hells Angels. Led by John Satan Maron, the club grew to 5,000 members in the 1970s and clashed with the Hells Angels due to territorial disputes. Their aggressive expansion across the East Coast sparked conflicts and violent confrontations throughout the 1980s and 1990s, resulting in casualties. Blaming each other for initiating the fights, the battle for territory escalated tensions. In 2002, a group of pagans attacked the Hells Angels in Planview, New York, further fueling the animosity. The pagans also aligned with Hells Angels rivals, including the Rock Machine Motorcycle Club leading to the deadliest motorcycle war, the Quebec Bike War. Number 3. Gremium Gremium is the largest biker group in Germany. Although Gremium began in Germany in 1972, it eventually spread to 71 other countries. Gremium's emergence as a rival to Hells Angels can be attributed to a combination of territorial disputes, conflicting ideologies, and power struggles within the biker subculture. As the largest biker group in Germany, Gremium posed a significant challenge to the dominance of Hells Angels, leading to an intense and enduring rivalry between the two. The rivalry between Gremium and Hells Angels escalated into a war that involved violent clashes, criminal activities, and a battle for control over lucrative criminal enterprises. Both groups vied for supremacy in the German underworld, particularly in the realms of drug trafficking, extortion, and organized crime. While the exact origins of Gremium remain elusive, it is believed that the group emerged as a splinter faction from various biker gangs, including Hells Angels. This historical connection between the two groups adds another layer of complexity to their rivalry, fueled by a sense of betrayal and a desire to assert independence. Number 2. Iron Horsemen The Iron Horsemen, founded in 1967, are a notorious outlaw motorcycle club and one of the top enemies of the Hells Angels.
their rivalry stems from territorial disputes and clashes over control of criminal activities. The two clubs have engaged in violent confrontations, particularly in Ohio and Kentucky, where they fight for dominance and control over lucrative illegal enterprises such as drug trafficking and prostitution. The Iron Horsemen and the Hells Angels often clash during biker events, resorting to brutal physical altercations and employing intimidation tactics against each other. Number 1. The Road Rats The Road Rats Motorcycle Club was founded in 1960. They are the oldest and toughest motorcycle club in the world. Their rivalry with the Hells Angels revolves around power struggles and criminal interests. The two clubs compete for dominance in the Midwest region of the United States, particularly in states like Illinois, Indiana, and Wisconsin. Turf wars and clashes arise as they seek control over criminal enterprises, including drug trafficking, arms smuggling, and organized crime activities. The Road Rats and the Hells Angels engage in violent encounters and retaliatory actions due to their aggressive and confrontational nature. So thanks for watching, folks. If you enjoyed the video, give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more videos.